Wait, wait, we gotta restart. <laughs> Alexa, shut up! Alexa, pause. Could you be nice? <laughs> She's a robot. You don't have to be nice to her. <laughs> YouTube, how the fuck you doing? Nate has Nate shot today. Uh, fuck. I haven't done this in a while. YouTube, how the fuck you doing? Nate has Nate shot today. Bringing a brand new video. And for the first time ever, Haley Hay is coming to Chicago. She's meeting my dad. She's meeting my family. Basically, people who made me who I am today. Haley, what are you most excited for when going to Chicago for the first time? <laughs> I'm excited to see your home, <laughs> to meet your dad, <laughs> and meet your family. No! I'm not excited for Portillo's, babe. I'm you not. have to be excited. Three hot dogs? Portillo's is the only reason why you should be excited to go to Chicago. No. We are on our way. We will see how it goes. Ah, uh, babe. You excited? Yeah. We made it. We made it. You really want to do this to yourself before you take off? Baby, who won last night? When's, when's the last time you beat me one on one? I won four consecutive games of Uno yesterday. One on one, just saying. Put us on the wrong side of the plane. The good view of Chicago's over there. We've got this, they've got skyscrapers. Sorry. Whoops. All right. <laughs> You don't have to get that close. It looks good. <laughs> we made it. We got a rental car. Woo! Bags are packed. Woo! I'm excited. We're gonna head to my dad's house. He actually just moved into a new home about a month ago. I'm actually not very familiar with the city that we're going to. I mean, we used to play them in baseball when I was a kid, but couldn't even tell you where we're going. It's kind of depressing. I'll show you around town though. It'll be good. I forgot the story that I was gonna tell him. I am not a very forgetful person when it comes to things that I need. We left the house at five o'clock. We boarded at 5.56. It took about 15 minutes to get to the airport. As we're like pulling in near the terminal, I realized I forgot my wallet. So I had to change the address in the Uber. He flew us back to the house. We grabbed my wallet another 15 or 20 minutes back. We got there at like 5.45. Luckily, since it was so early, there really wasn't any traffic. But while we were checking in, we were standing right next to Michael Jackson's entire family. Couldn't recognize a single one of them. Nope. But Very that's what strange. the gate check woman was saying that it was, there was like 20 people. Yeah. And they were all flying first class, I think. Yeah. So I'm not sure what the hell was going on or what they're using Mike's money for, but they're balling out of control. It is time. <laughs> the first ever real authentic in-store Portillo's experience. Mm. Please tell me you're excited. I'm so excited. Yeah, so we're at Portillo's. This is always my first stop when I land in Chicago. It's like comfort, home food. You only have them in Chicago. And then obviously they have one in Anaheim, which I took uh, courage to. <laughs> Four hot dogs. So what you're gonna try first is this Chicago hot dog. Okay. Make sure it's big bite. It's gotta be real big bite so you get everything. Okay. Oh. Don't mess this up. <laughs> the actual hot dog itself, fantastic. Onions, pickle relish, mmm, ketchup. Ooh, so you like it. I do like it. We've got the french fries, chicken tenders. What do you want me to nah, do? Now you put your little elbows on the table. Oh, you've never... Baby, what? <laughs> I'm trying to help you. So we just had probably 4,000 calories of food. Haley loved the hot dog, said it was probably the best part. Now what we gotta do is a bite of the chocolate cake. No, the cake shake is not better. Chocolate cake. Chocolate shake is better. So here's the bite you're gonna take. Give me a small one. No, no. I'm not taking that bite. You know I'm not taking that bite. Yes, you have that to. That is not fitting in my mouth. <laughs> Down. <laughs> you don't want this? All right. <laughs> there. Half of that. No. <laughs> Why aren't you participating? Great. 10 out of 10. I don't right? like chocolate, so. Oh, yeah, I always forget. <laughs> Are you serious? I thought you were fucking with me. I thought you were. <laughs> Did you just swing in front of children? What's wrong with you? You're not gonna break up with me because I forgot you didn't like chocolate, right? No. No? No. Positive experience? Yeah, it was great. Yeah? Did you yeah. like it? Yeah. Great. What's Portillo's? What? Golden hour. What'd you say? Golden hour. My favorite hour of the day. <laughs> you love the sun, I know. I, I knew that. Okay. <laughs> Progress. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Haley and I are moving our way into the bowels, the downtown Chicago. Look, Sears Tower right there. Hey, we are 
staying in a hotel. Haley's never been to the city, so I'm excited to show her around. I just want you to have a nice view of the city from the room. I appreciate that. Yeah. Hey, you know, care about you a little bit here and there. Oh. Not a lot. I, I love her. <laughs> okay. Uh, you turn it off now. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, what a what a night. It's been a good day. I, you know what? I'm gonna get this off. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about it. Okay. I'm gonna talk about it. Listen, we were at my dad's house earlier. We leave my dad's house. I decided that we're gonna stay at the Trump International. It's one of the few five-star hotels I saw, but it was like triple the price compared to other hotels that we could have stayed at. But I knew that the Trump Hotel had a great view of the city, and that was my main goal for Haley to see. We have a really great view. You can't tell right now. Yeah, we do have a great view. We do. We do have a great we view. We yeah. have a great view. We uh, we get to the hotel, everything's fine. The valet, they ask if we want help with our bags. We say yes, absolutely. Tip the guy, get to the front desk. Guy offers me a room upgrade for like a hundred bucks with a better view. I say, yeah, absolutely, let's do it. What happened was we never got our bags. Well, I'll call the front desk. Call the front desk, nobody answers. I call the bell desk, nobody answers. I actually had to go downstairs and ask for my bags. Says, okay, well, they're in a different place. I can't give you the bags right now, but I'll try to find them. So I come back upstairs. 15 minutes later, yeah. still no bags. And we're trying to go to dinner. It's a Sunday night. Restaurants it's are like closing. Nine. There was no line checking in. There's nobody at this hotel. It was really strange. So I go back downstairs and they don't know where my fucking bags are. I don't know. That seems like an unnecessary rant. Whole point of the story, five-star hotel, terrible service, didn't have my bags for an hour. Almost missed our dinner reservation. But a beautiful view, baby. Beautiful and view. I know you wanted the view, and I'm gonna love the view right now and when we wake up in the morning. I want a five-star experience. You can't stay at the five-star hotel and get that service. Yeah. You can't. I sound like a dickhead. Okay, probably not gonna see in the vlog. So we're at the Trump International downtown Chicago. Come in, nice random plant. Don't know where this door leads. Probably to another room. It's locked. Probably just woke up our neighbors. Feel a little bad about that. Bathroom. Uh, it's not bad. You know, it looks good. Walk inside. Haley Hay, with the jumper, <laughs> is making drinks. Perfect. Wait, can we just talk about, you look good. Thank you, baby. Oh, wait, tell me. What are we rocking? What's going on here? Nice Let me get a fit coat. check. Oh, damn, all right. Got some nice Louis boots. Ooh. Fancy. Shiny pants. <laughs> Shiny pants. A big smile. <laughs> <laughs> and then you come into the main living quarters and we have a TV which is oddly very far away from the bed, which is one of my complaints. That TV is not big enough for this room. There's a little bit of reflection, but you can see the clock tower. This is the river that cuts through Chicago. Wait, let me show them. Okay. Oh, ooh. So they, what, how it should start off is, you know, like, my look, yeah. you know? Mm. Yeah, baby, look great. Well, I fucking hate myself. Oh man, what a view, what a view. Chicago really is beautiful. It's a gorgeous view. It's probably the only positive of the Trump International Hotel. Okay? Because I'm back on this motherfucker. <laughs> no, ladies and gentlemen, we are in day number two for the holidays here in Chicago, and we are ready to explore. Now, there was a slight pain in my heart when Haley said the only thing she wanted to do. Not the only thing. Stop. She wants to go see the bean, the I famous do. bean in Chicago. I've never really understood the draw to it, but I guess I've seen it and I've been there. I'm gonna go grab lunch and then my dad gets home from work at three. I still need to do some Christmas shopping, which I haven't really figured out when that's gonna happen. Ooh, we could do that. I love to shop. <laughs> yeah? yeah? Make your little, uh, your head little things a twirl. Come on, let's Ready? see it, yeah. Oh! <laughs> I gotta play a song, hold on, hold on. What do we got? Okay, show me what you got. <laughs> I whip that out sometimes. <laughs> Wait, no, you, that's an aggressive whip. It looks good though. Tell me where we're at. We're up really high at the signature room. On 95th. On 95th. Yeah, a little bit of day drinking responsibly. Mm -hmm. We got a little bit more drinking to do when my dad gets home tonight, so we gotta be responsible. But, whoa. You could see the shadow of the John Hancock building where we're at, right there in the water. No, but we're 95 floors up. We got a view of Chicago. We got Lake Michigan. We got a beautiful view here. Oh. Arguably better oh, than the one out there. But I'm glad we actually, we got out of our hotel and we're doing stuff in the city. Yeah, I can't wait. <laughs> hey, you happy now? <laughs> so happy. <laughs> so all she wanted to do was see the bean. This entire piece of vlog is just gonna be you looking and admiring the bean. <laughs> Should we do one of those stereotypical where you're walking forward and I hold your hand? And it's like, yeah. <laughs> Hell no. 
There we are. We look great. Ooh, shit. Hold up. Ooh, first touch. It's like uh, the arrival or some sort of yeah. sci-fi. Yeah. It's so pretty, babe. Hey, stop. It's so pretty. Oh, shit. Oh, goddamn. Oh, all right. What did you think of the bean? Really cool. It is a beautiful piece of art that yeah. should be seen in person at some point in time or another. The bean is great because it's like the only place where you can turn the camera on. Nobody is like, oh, look at this fucking guy. Okay, now turn it around to you. Oh. Turn it around, have it face you. And now you're vlogging. Okay. So give us an update. So we just went to go visit the bean. Then we went and saw the rest of Millennial Park. It was kind of cool, it was very futuristic. Then my favorite part, we went to the, what is it called, athletic club? The Chicago Athletic Club. Chicago Athletic Club to play some pool. I beat Matt at a pool. You did beat me, I, I will admit that. Then we went to the hotel, grabbed our bags. Here we are to the road to go see that shot. <laughs> That shot. <laughs> I like that little twist. Oh, you're meant for this. You're built for this to do it. My arm. It's it's heavy, right? It's heavy. <laughs> <laughs> so I think we're gonna stop at a couple gas stations like 7-Eleven because I'm gonna get a bunch of lottery tickets for my dad to scratch off. It's gonna be great. Yay. I'm gonna get him like $500 worth of lottery tickets. It's gonna be awesome. Hmm. Okay, guys, we got lottery tickets for dad shots. Look at all these. Ultimate Millions, Gold Rush. Pay me, we've got more. I hope I'm getting these. Oh, I'm probably messing this up, babe. Jackpot, five million. Dad Shaw's gonna be so happy. What is it? Well, oh, take the bag and look. Oh, I thought you were handing me that. <laughs> no, I'm gonna hand you the Red Bull. This one's mine, I haven't had caffeine all day. <laughs> There's like $500 of lottery tickets right there. We're gonna do it. <laughs> you making some piles? Yeah. Oh my God. So you told him about the lottery tickets already, right? I did, but I probably didn't do a good job. You didn't do a good job? We've made it. Dad Shot is making his return. Oh my God, I forgot. <laughs> what you got going on over there, Jeff? Dog sitting. No. Yeah, you having a good time? Yes. He's my baby. About two years ago, Catherine back here took my dad and I to the gas station and the grocery store three different times when we were fucked up, we were drunk, to buy more and more lottery tickets because we kept winning. I figure that's gotta become a tradition now. So we're all gonna scratch off one before we go to dinner. All right, all right, well, I'll pass them out. Here, okay. <laughs> Say it again. The rich get richer, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm going to work Monday. Scratch below it to see what you won, the prize money. It's probably gonna be like five bucks. $25! Oh, we're recouping some of our funds. <laughs> Hey, Jack. We call him Jackalope. Jack, say something. Here's what we're gonna... Oh, nice. Hey, Jack. Meow. Meow. All right, guys. This was a really, really long day. I mean, we went on an adventure today. We started downtown at the Trump. We traveled back to the suburbs, hung out with my dad all night. I did not turn on the camera too much hanging out with my dad just because the thing about vlogging is you got to like set up moments. I just had a great time hanging out with him and enjoying every second of it since I don't see him very often. We went out to dinner. We came back. We played a couple board games. We only won 150 bucks out of $500 on lottery oh, scratch offs. I forgot I forgot to give the update on that. Hey, <laughs> we're back like some drug addicts, Woo! right? Yeah, hold on. Got my quarter. <laughs> <laughs> So it's day three here in Chicago, Christmas Eve. We went to Top Golf earlier. We went over to my dad's parents' house. We had a great time, uh, but we dipped out a little early and we're having a couple drinks now, but we made one more stop at the gas station. Lottery tickets after lottery tickets after lottery tickets and lottery tickets. Let's teach these kids how to make a gin and tonic. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Yeah, show me. Hold on, let me get the time. Uh, I've been criticized, I like Schweppes, but a lot of you kids called me out on it and said Q-Tonic is the way to go, so that's what I'm doing. So you get your Q-Tonic ice, get your lime. And the Yeti cup. Bombay gin, you pour. One, 1,000, two, 1,000, three, 1,000. Fill half the cup. <laughs> the lime, squeeze, ooh, a lot of juice, that was a giver. Add the tonic, oh, not enough gin. <laughs> mix and play lotto. <laughs> Cheers to Matt and Haley. I enjoy them. Yeah, Merry right. Christmas, everybody. Cheers. Is it recording? Yeah. Yeah, all right. How the fuck did you pull this off? Where did you get this made? I found an embroiderer. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Look at it. That's awesome. <laughs> 
This is fucking incredible. Hey, go, I love your golf game. <laughs> <laughs> this is like to the T. And my logo. Logan sent me that, and that's a logo you sent me. Wait, Logan? Logan sent me the 100 Thieves. My editor? Yeah, he had to do it two times because I was a moron. I couldn't find them. <laughs> I couldn't like reproduce it on my email. Well, Logan's gonna edit this, so. <laughs> <laughs> Wiz helped me with the bag. I want to know what you guys use out there. Oh. So Wiz helped. I hope you like it. I fucking love it. Are you kidding me? You didn't have to ship it to me though. <laughs> yeah, <all right. laughs> These are all the tickets that we fucking lost. We won $50. There's one ticket out of the fucking 20 that we've scrapped. Reveal this symbol, you win double that prize. Oh, 40 bucks lit. 40 bucks? Oh, so 40 double? Oh, hey, I'm happy with that. I'm not. I'm really not, but um, go ahead. <laughs> I'm not. Fucking shit. Put the kiss me back. I took off work today for this. Hold <laughs> on, what did you say? Harm Thieves is on the wall. We're, we're. All right, nice work done. <laughs> hey, hey, but it, it's okay, because I'm going to teach you guys a life lesson. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, no. I'm, I'm, no, I actually got it. I'm going to teach you guys a life lesson. Life sucks, and then you die, and then you lose money on lottery tickets. 32 years of this shit. I'm going back to work Monday, so I <laughs> see you there. <laughs> uh, we should have made this a... Uh, uh, life sucks, and then you die, and then you lose money on lottery tickets. That's actually like a great saying. All right, for the state of Illinois, we just made it. Great. Man. <laughs>